let's look at the amino acid cysteine at a specific pH. So here I've drawn cysteine, and I've shown you the pKa's of each group. So the pKa of this proton, the pKa of one of these protons, and the pKa of this proton. The question is, at pH 5, what's the overall charge? So what are the protonation states? Is the overall charge plus 1, 0, or minus 1? Think about that for a minute and make a selection. Let's look at a possible explanation for each answer. A. pH 5 is acidic, so H plus will be added, making the charge plus 1. B, the sum of all the charges at pH 5 are 0. Or C, the acidic form, COO minus, will dominate at pH 5, so the charge will be minus 1. Think about those three and make a selection. We're looking at the amino acid cysteine at pH 5. So we have to compare the pH to each individual pKa and determine the protonation state at each site. So for instance, here the pKa is 9, so the pH is less than the pKa. If the pH is less than the pKa, you're on the acidic side, so the acidic form predominates. In fact, your four units away from this. So you're four units to the acidic side. So this is all in its acidic form. Its acidic form is the triprotonated state. And you know for a nitrogen with three protons and a carbon attached, that has a positive charge. Now here, pKa8, again, the pH is 5, well to the acidic side. So the acidic side here is predominating, and the acidic side is the one with the proton attached. So the acidic form is the one with the proton attached. For this sulfurous side group, that's neutral. Here, pKa2, this is the carboxylic acid part of the molecule. The pKa is 2. Now I'm on the basic side. The pH is 5. The pKa is 2. So I'm at a pH above the pKa. On the basic side, so the basic form predominates. The basic form is the form without the proton. So I lose this proton. When I lose that proton, of course, I leave behind a negative charge. So the overall charge on the molecule is determined by the negative charge at pH 5 on the carboxylic acid group and the positive charge at pH 5 on the ammonium group. So in this case, the overall charge is 0, minus 1, plus 1, and 0, all sum to 0.